All right, so you can see behind me, I just left the movie theater, AMC. Just finished watching Mad Max, Ferosa. Man, that's a good origin story of her, man. It's, they did a very good job, but it's two hours and 28 minutes, but it felt like four hours, even them previews, man. There's five parts in it. They do a good origin story of Ferosa. I mean, right from the beginning, it's just, man, the special effects, the storyline. Now, it's really about the two guys D Demetrius and um, Immortal Joe, those two warlords fighting each other. So for most of the movie, she's just a supporting like actor. But then at the end, you're gonna see her be the main actor of the storyline. So you're gonna have her where um, Demetrius is gonna find her and he wants to, her to give up some information about the, where she's from because it's supposed to be a very beautiful land when everything is a wasteland where she lived at. It's all green acres water and that's very valuable at this time in the post-apocalyptic world and then you're going to have where he's going to come across immortal joe where she wants to take over his particular castle but they're going to have a showdown between those two but man she does a very good job and this one leads right into mad max um furry road right into that series right into it man and just stay at the end because they're going to show you some highlights of the the previous movie so but um Hey, it's an egg movie. Go check it out, especially if you're a woman. You'll like it.